Hi, my name is Bob Greener and I'm a volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project. So if you want to get an understanding of how weird my life is sometime, uh, on the, the April the 5th, 2023, I bought a book. And I bought it from the US and they said it might take six or so weeks to be delivered. Anyway, uh, the reason I bought this book is because it had this, the Sothic Triangle, in there. And this was the first time that I had seen uh, a detailed image of the Sothic Triangle. Anyway, uh, I came to the UK yesterday, uh, early morning, and uh, uh, in preparation for uh, helping uh, secure the material of Lion. And I went via London down to my sister's. And on the way there, I went to the British Museum. Anyway, uh, what was I taking a picture of in the British Museum? I was taking a picture of this. It's an Assyrian stele. And uh, one of the things that I'm interested in, of course, is these things that they have around their wrists. And uh, you've got the Tree of Life here. And if we zoom in over here, we have the flying disc of the sky, uh, flying uh, sky god's uh, headdress. And we have like the Maltese cross, the symbol of God controlled power. And up here we have the actual flying disc here. And if I go down, I can show you a, a higher resolution version of that. So really beautiful images I caught of this. Anyway, uh, the when I got down to my sister's, the book had arrived. And the book is called this. The Lion Path. You can take it with you. A manual for the short path to regeneration for our times. And here we go. And so when I'm looking into this book for the first time, a few uh, minutes back, I was going to page 50 here. And this is what I found on it. This is a wing disc with a wing. It says Masters of the Domain of Time, Divine Regents of Heaven and Initiates of Life Eternal. And so this is the original Egyptian one. And here we see the kind of Syrian one, and here is the exact one that I decided I wanted to take a picture of yesterday in the British Museum. That is exactly where it is held. And these are the Iranian versions here. And then you get through to the Indian versions here. And then the final, the Christian version. The winged or flying disc with its nascent divinity implied or shown explicitly spread from ancient Egypt and reappeared characteristically stylized in Sumerian, Babylonian, B, Assyrian, C, Iranian and DE, Indian and FG and finally Christian form, H or angel. Okay. <laughs> So that is how weird my life is sometime. So uh, tomorrow I will be uh, going up to a place in London, which is nearby where the lockup is, the storage location. And then I will, um, the following morning, I will pick up a five meter cubed van and uh, we will be going with a, someone hopefully to help me to sort out the wheat from the chaff and then it will be driven about five and a half hours up to the storage location. So Lion, thank you for everything you did for us. It's a weird, weird time, but uh, there we have it. We have the winged disc, the Syrian version. Thank you for your time and I'll see you in the next video.